Alright ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another video. As you have probably guessed by the title, today we are gonna talk about a problem that's been a bane of Paladin's existence as a game and also as my life career path of choice. Player numbers have been officially hitting zero for Paladins this weekend as all veteran Paladins players are moving to Modern Combat 5 as well as potential new players who also got distracted by this game new update that brought story mode and also new skins for the upcoming battle royale mode. This will not only devastate Australia, but the devs might be forced to shift their attention from Paladins to their latest hit game Divine Knockout, which has been going to the moon so to speak in terms of online users as well as content creators on Twitch. But what can we do this to fix this? Well, there is no clear answer to this question since Paladins is a very complex game. So let's divide this topic into three parts, in which I'll give my best shot at explaining what's wrong with Paladins as of now and how can we fix it. Flanks are underpowered. With their recent hard-hitting nerfs to Androxus, most of the gaming community of Paladins have questioned further playing because the last nerf to his best talent, and it really meant that it's over for most Androxus pro players. There have been also reports of disparate Androxus players plugging in controllers with hope that maybe the auto aim might give them the slight edge they lost in this unjustified nerf. I also contacted the best known to me Androxus player, Creepers YouTube, and he had these words to say on this nerf. I'm over here stroking my dick, I got lotion on my dick right now, I'm just stroking my shit. I'm horny as fuck. And finally, we still haven't received the Albanian flag spray, which was really anticipated not only by Albanian players, but also highly upvoted as a change by AOC representatives from Honolulu and Pakistan. Hopefully, with those changes implemented, Hi-Res will be back bowling, and Paladins will not only not be shut down, but it will live maybe for the next 12 months. Thank you all for watching, please donate to my Patreon and follow me on Twitter. Peace out.